This is a WECT Cape Fear Business Break. Hello, I'm Eric Hine. With me again is Dr. Alex Yip with Allergy Partners. How are you, Dr. Yip? I'm doing fine, thanks. Great to see you again. Uh, today I want to talk a little bit about peanut allergies because it's my understanding they're becoming a little bit more common. Um, so what information can you give us about peanut allergies for patients or families that are affected? Well, peanut allergy is act actually very common and unfortunately it seems to be on the rise and we're really not sure why it's on the rise. There's been some theories that it's just a more common item in, our, uh, in the United States diets and so we're getting more and more exposure to it. The other thing is there may be something about how the peanut is processed, like roasting peanuts may actually increase their allergenicity. And because of that, we're seeing higher levels of peanut allergy in kids nowadays. When I was a kid, I don't remember having any friends who had peanut allergy. Now you're going to see peanut allergy commonly in schools. Peanut allergy it occurs in about 1% of kids in the United States, and it's about 0.6% in adults. And the important thing about peanut allergy is the only treatment currently available is avoidance. You have to avoid peanut. You have to read labels. You have to make sure you don't eat foods that are unlabeled. And the other thing is having treatment available, an epinephrine injection device is absolutely essential in the treatment of peanut allergy and you should always carry it with you especially when you're going to a place where you may have food like restaurants, family, ha families houses or friends homes. Okay and can peanut allergies come at you basically at any time in your life or? Peanut allergy certainly can develop at any point in life but actually it tends to be more common to present in kids and then it unfortunately is one of the few food allergies that is not outgrown. Only 20 percent of kids may actually outgrow their peanut allergy over time. Fantastic information. Thank you very much, Dr. Yip, for your time. I appreciate that. You can learn more by visiting their website. Go to www.allergypartners.com. This has been a WECT Business Break.